Today is the muck out day for the shed. And the kind of thing I do is a composting in the shed. So it's a mixture, the bottom layer is straw, next layer is wood chip, then straw, then wood chip, then straw. And you can see the sides. That's what it looks like on the sides. I have boards that run across here. It's already really started composting. This is full of, um, when we took the boards away, it's, this is rock hard, by the way. Really, really hard. And the, um, it's already composting in of itself. The bottom is almost soil. We're getting that way. And um, it doesn't even, the smell on my hand doesn't even smell like shit. It smells like soil. So this was started last year. Last autumn, we put the straw layer down, then housed animals on it, or animals came in and out. Then we put the wood chip down, and that was there for a long time, and then the straw. And uh, it works really, really well. So this is gonna be cleaned out uh, today. A lad's coming with a machine to do it. Put in a pile in the field, and then after not very long, it'll be spread because it's already doing its um, composting underneath. So it's very compact all the way along. Here you can see it's less compact in here. It's a bit loose, but that's okay because the rotation of that stuff through it will make it really, really good fertile stuff to spread in the fields. So that's the creation of soil food. The dogs love this part. They love munching on these dried bits of, um, as I call it, pre-cooked vegetable matter for canines. So that's what they get. Instead of, in the wild, the canines or any predators eat the part of the gut where the vegetables are cooked before they go into the rest of the intestines of the herbivores that they eat. So instead of doing that, dogs eat manure to get the microbiology and vegetables and all kinds of things that they can't necessarily digest, that the herbivores have already digested for them in the ruminants, or with the horses, it's not a ruminant. Hey bear, are you joining in the fun of eating horse and sheep shit that's well rotted? full of microbiology. So it's the kind of stuff that you can't get in dog food and make in dog food. It's a kind of cocktail that's very natural to uh, carnivores and herbivores. And supposedly we humans, that was part of what we used to eat was, uh, there's a name for it and I can't remember what it's called, which is that little area between the stomach and the beginning of the intestines. And that area was supposedly a delicacy for humans because it was fermented food. It was a fermented vegetable and fermented vegetables are really, really, really healthy and good for us and full of all kinds of nutrition. So this is fermented, or rather this is composted manure, pea, straw, and wood chips. So this is, Food for the soil. So he's taken the first bite and you can see the layers. And it really, there's no real bad, there's a very earthy smell. You can see the compacted layers of straw and the wood chip. You can see the darkness of the wood chip, but it's, uh, it's great stuff, it's almost, already composted in underneath. Not much more will be needed to do. Here you can totally see the layers. It's like the layers of soil or rock, a rock face. So you can see the straw, here's where the wood chip was, more straw, wood, more wood chip. 
So you can see the layers of the composting and how it's working. So a million years from now, that might be a stone face somewhere. You never know, except it won't be. It'll be spread out all over our fields to feed the soil. And that's just in 15 minutes. So that's about a third of the shed mucked out. The manpower in that one machine is extraordinary. It would take me ages to muck this out by hand. Oh, I don't even want to think about how long and how backbreaking it would be. So sometimes big machines are good, even though it's compacting the soil a bit there. Job done. Now all I have to do is power hose this shed. Get all the muck out, clean everything up. So big job of power hosing. Probably start that tomorrow or maybe this evening. So all for the next, get ready for the next season. You can see all the uh, Fencing for the yard and the sheep race are all out here. So that's the next stage is power hosing. What fun. <laughs>